Now Sports with Jared Joseph. The SEC is calling all 14 athletics directors to the league's offices in Birmingham, Alabama on Monday, July 13th to discuss fall sports scheduling amid COVID-19. Now, according to Sports Illustrated, Commissioner Greg Sankey is using the summit to get feedback from each school's AD about proceeding forward with fall sports. The meeting has been planned for at least two weeks, meaning Power 5 schools like the Big Ten going to conference-only schedules have not caused this gathering to take place. But according to NPR, the SEC does have seven of the top 11 states in the country with the largest increases in the virus. Now, the league is expected to discuss contingency plans during the gathering. And the virus has been impacting professional athletes' ability to train as well, restricting players' access to team facilities. Now, former Saints offensive lineman LaCharles Bentley has made a second career out of training. The Ohio State alum founded O-Line Performance, the first invitation-only training club for NFL offensive linemen. And although Bentley can't meet with players in person, the Cleveland native is still preparing players for the 2020 season. The virtual training system that we put together has really been uh, a key element in keeping athletes ready. The function of that was to uh, keep the core engaged, keeping and maintaining a level of explosion, but obviously all without the implementation of heavy weight room equipment. It was the rubber band base, a towel, uh, a lot of different plank type positions. It was just a minimal approach, but at the same time was functional in regards to the demands of our sport, which is football. Of course, hoping to see the Saints in the black and gold this fall coming up. That'll do it for sports. We'll be right back.